The employee gateway is on location, underground Heritage Hall. This area is not open to the public, so enjoy our sneak peek at what goes on at the heart of the athletics program. Katie is going to show us around. Hi, my name is Katie Ryan and I'm an Assistant Sports Information Director here at USC. This is the first thing our student athletes see as they leave the lobby of Heritage Hall to come downstairs. This photo is called the 21 and it represents the 21 sports that we have here at USC. Each student athlete in this photo is a team captain of their sport. We redo this picture every year, and most recently, we took our photo at Terranea. Let's keep going downstairs. So tell us a bit about the building. While there's so many outstanding collegiate athletic facilities across the country, they don't all have the same rich tradition and heritage that USC does. When we were designing this building, we really wanted to emphasize the story of USC athletics. If you look at the walls throughout our facility, they really showcase our various programs and tell the history of those teams and what they've done throughout their time at USC. In addition, we really like to emphasize and showcase some individual athletes that have been really special for us. So these are our nap pods within our women's athletic lounge and this space gives our female student athletes a place where they can get away from practice in the classroom, you know, just really relax. I like it. Here we are in our state-of-the-art weight room below the McKay Center. All 21 of our sports have the opportunity to utilize this weight room and in fact, here we have Porter Gustin, outside linebacker, number 45 on the football team, and as you can tell, he frequents this facility. Yeah, uh, this is for sure my favorite place to be. Um, the house of gains, what we do in here, transfers on the field, you know. Yeah, I'm here day and night, more than my own house, actually. Football, basketball, what else goes on here? So we have an outstanding men's and women's golf program here at USC and we're currently in their golf room. These are two golf simulators that we have. So with USC being downtown, it makes it a little bit difficult to actually access some golf courses. So with these simulators, our teams are able to practice on any course in the world. And this is all pressure sensitive, so the further they hit, the further the ball is gonna go down the course. And these simulators also provide feedback for our golfers. Also in this space, we have our team dietitians. So every team here at USC has a specific team nutritionist that caters to the individual needs of our student athletes. Oh yeah, yeah. Porter has like 17 of them, so. Unfortunately, none of them have my name on it, so. <laughs> So at USC, we like to have our athletes in prime physical condition at all times. And here we have the top athletic trainers and doctors on the staff at all times helping our athletes. And after practice, they can come in here and soak in the hot tub or in the cold tub. Mind if I give you a few tips? Uh, I'm good, thanks. Oh, okay. Actually, uh, this is USC Women's Rowing head coach Josh Adam. Oh, oh. nice to meet you, nice Coach. Nice to meet you. How about those tips now? You know what? Why don't, why don't you tell us about the facilities? <laughs> okay. So this is the USC Women's Rowing Ergometer Room. This is also a cardio-based room for us. This is our room when we're not on the water. We can use this to train our heart and to train our lungs. 
so that we can get a little bit faster when we don't have an opportunity to be on the water. Well, there you have it. You've been on location with the Employee Gateway here underground at Heritage Hall. I'm going to row on out of here with Coach. There you go.